let me tell you the most remarkable experience I've had. Um, I don't know which year. 90, 90, is it 1994, 95, 96? I don't know. That the Pope came to Nigeria. You remember? Pope John Paul yeah, Pope II. The second. Yeah, one of those years. I was in my aunt's balcony painting. I had my friend Stan, who who was uh, my old schoolmate, and he was like my manager. And then we were all fresh out of school and navigating the Lagos hustle world. So the Pope was coming to Nigeria, and I said, I would like my painting to be in the Pope's collection. And it sounded a bit like Pinky and the Brain, you know? Just a bunch of my, my, mice in the, in the cage <laughs> and saying, no, not what are you going to you're do? Not anyone. What are you going to do? We are going to take over the world. <laughs> Love rats. <laughs> <laughs> so nobody knew who I was. So how am I going to get my painting to the Pope? You know that kind of thing. Yeah. And the Pope, you know the one that the Pope finished coming, Abacha went and died, and Nigeria yeah, yeah, yeah. like, <laughs> the Pope has done it for us. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so, <laughs> so, so I was like, awesome, man. So me and my friend, we are headstrong. We're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So what type of painting are we going to do? We're just busy thinking about it, you know? And I always tell this story to just to explain this, what people call miracle or whatever. And then the phone rings. And then somebody says, oh, Kelechi, um, Nigerian um, Council of Bishops or something uh, are planning to give a present to the Pope. And I recommended you to them that you could make a painting. Wow. So uh, I've set up an appointment with uh, the Secretary General of Nigerian Catholic Secretariat, Father Kuka. Okay. <laughs> God. I said, for real? He said, yes. Yeah. It's okay, I'm, I'm going to be there. I met for the cooker. Really, it just didn't make sense. But then they say, throw it out in the universe. Yeah. You know? So I met with for the cooker. And, you know, interesting chap. Yeah. First of all, his office was a wall of books. I'm like, man, this guy, did you read all these books? <laughs> anyway, the guy spoke to me, said, you know, with his. Uh, his uh, accent. I love that his accent. Yeah, no. <laughs> He's, you know, we, we would like to make a painting of uh, Father Tansi we want to give to the Pope. Oh, you think you can do that? But I negotiated with this guy. They paid me. I made this painting, framed it, put it in a box, put my complimentary card at the back of the <laughs> and <laughs> delivered to them. That's and that's they that's sent it to the Pope. Several months later, he yeah. sent me a letter from the Vatican. Oh, wow. Acknowledging that, you know, they had received oh, it. Fantastic. And so it was So it was one of the most remarkable things that happened to me, you know, as a beginner. It taught me that truly, whatever it is you are interested in doing, send it out there to the universe. And don't bother about whether it's going to happen or how it's going to happen. Just send it out. Cool. So that's a great story.